Jeremiah Usukoromoa uh, was asked about Brown's belief in him and the fact that he is a foundational piece uh, of the current defense, the Mount Rushmore of this defense, if you will. Well, I'm not quite at those le those guys' levels. I may be on one of the hills around here in Cleveland. Uh, <laughs> they're, they're up there. Uh, but as time goes on, you know, I look to be where they're at. I look to uh, transcend the mountain and continue to work to be the best player and teammate that I can. So I saw that they, you know, traded up, right? So that obviously there's some type of value that they see in me, right? Of course, I see that they're extending me. So obviously there's some type of value there uh, that, that they hold for me. So, you know, I honor that again. You know, I appreciate that. And it's my, again, my duty and my responsibility to answer to those those calls or that uh, that specialness uh, that's been bestowed upon me. And they, um, the reason he said it that way is they, they referred to him as special because the Browns traded up and extended him, and they don't typically sink money into the linebacker room. So, I, again, he's really good, and he's ascending. Yeah, and I think obviously saying all the right things, I think saying that he feels like he hasn't arrived by saying he wouldn't put himself on the Mount Rushmore of the defense. And if you obviously want to frame that obviously around Miles Garrett and Denzel Ward, they've been doing it for years. And, you know, Garrett was a 2017 draft pick, Denzel Ward 2018. So they got four or five years on JOK as far as NFL experience. And JOK right now, yeah, he's played he played very well last season. Now let's see. Now I think the next step for him is – be even better and continue to do it consistently. And I think if he does that, you can certainly start to put him in that discussion for that Mount Rushmore, the defense. But right now you're still building it around Garrett and Ward.